I was thinking about how every time we retreat from a moment, either confidence-wise or fear-wise, we think there's a physical barrier like limiting our move forward, but there isn't. And I just wanted to express that, that it all comes down to uh, moving forward and that we could actually physically be free with our minds because uh, there's literally no limit. But not to say that when you uh, retreat, like if you're going and then you retreat, there's obviously, you obviously did physically truly retreat. So the result of a mental barrier or a thought limitation or a fear or a retreat is the same as if there would be a real barrier. But I'm just saying that there isn't. Straight up to the point where you can make things uh, move with your mind or however you want to say it. If you'd actually continue going, you would get that promotion, that girl, that event. If you didn't retreat. I'm not saying I know how to do it. I'm just saying that the philosophy is that you literally think you can't do something, but you could. You just continue. That the barrier doesn't exist, but if you are afraid and pull back, it's as if it does exist. But the truth is, you stick with it. You're already free because we're in a free universe that's freely flowing. Our societal systems haven't caught up to that. But I think I'm going to keep expressing it until we could realize it because I think it's already true. And other scientists have already realized that energy wise, but we have to do it consciously, like as alive beings. That's my video for today.